Rachel, a narrow defeat here against a top side. How do you reflect on the game here at the Smisa Stadium? Yeah, it's obviously disappointing to lose, but we knew coming into the game it was going to be a, a tough one for us. They're, they've obviously won the silver medal at the Olympics, so we knew what it was going to be. And I think first half we've dug in deep to see it out to the half. And second half we've come out with a game plan and unfortunately it's not went our way tonight. They had a lot of quality that they could bring off the bench as well, didn't they? And that showed in the second half. Yeah, you can see the strength and depth in their squad. I think fatigue kicked in at the end there with ourselves. Um, we've put a lot of work into that and rightly so. It's, it's always going to be tough for us, but... Yeah, I think we can walk away with our heads held high and we can definitely use that to our advantage going into the next qualifiers. And of course, in a proud moment for you, I'm sure, as well, albeit uh, in a defeat, but you, you had the captain's armband. How do you reflect on that? Yeah, it's always an honour. I think Rachel Corsi panicked a wee bit when she was coming <laughs> off. She was looking around and I was the first one there. But no, in all seriousness, it's an absolute yeah. honour. I've absolutely loved playing for my country and it's something I will, I'll never forget. How do you reflect on this camp, Rachel? Obviously, we picked up a dramatic late win on Friday, and that's obviously the result that we'll remember and take with us. But how's the camp been as a whole? Yeah, I think it's been a positive one. Um, I think coming in off the back of two wins, we were coming in full of high spirits, uh, carried that on on Friday night. We, we felt the performance wasn't there, but as you say, we got the result, which is all that matters. And then coming into this one, it was a, a good tough test for us leading into the next two matches. Yeah, how important is it to play an opposition like Sweden ahead of two difficult games against Ukraine and Spain next month? Yeah, it's huge. Every international game you play is, is going to be tough, but they're the next level and it's good to see and test ourselves against the best.